Good afternoon. I'm Dave Percy at the National Weather Service here in Anchorage, Alaska, and this is Friday's Alaska Statewide Weather. Clouds and showers extended over the eastern Alaska range into the upper Tanana Valley and 40 mile country with uh, four tenths of an inch of precipitation falling during the day today at, on Upper Chena, and about a quarter of an inch fell at Toke with Nabesna picking up roughly about two tenths of an inch of rain as well as Chisana. Some showers uh, popped up along the southeast coast as well, with, uh, about a tenth of an inch falling at Gustavus and two tenths at Sitka. Otherwise, it was just generally cloudy elsewhere across the Panhandle. Sunshine is breaking out over the southwest interior, as well as from areas uh, from the roughly Kobuk Valley eastward across the Koyukuk into the upper Yukon, with temperatures rising into the 60s to near 70 toward the eastern border. Flurries along the central and portions of the Arctic coast with patchy fog will persist tonight along the east side, but no significant amounts are expected, but will reduce visibilities as a trough pulls off into Mackenzie River Bay and Delta. Otherwise, high pressure will dominate the northern central Bering Sea, but a front will bring rain, fog, and drizzle, and a little bit of an increase in some gusty southeast winds to Kodiak Island tonight and locally into Bristol Bay. Then on Saturday, that low center will lift north of the eastern Aleutians into the southeast Bering Sea, and that will drive the frontal boundary up into the southwest interior. Rain will increase along the southern Kenai Peninsula and Kamishak Bay throughout the day. It'll stay wet across Kodiak Island and clouds will increase over south central Alaska. But it'll be sunny over the Panhandle and isolated thunderstorms are possible over the eastern interior, mostly around Northway and Toke, just south of Eagle. Otherwise, mostly interior Alaska will be mostly sunny and a little warmer. And then on Sunday, look for uh, high temperatures, 75 to maybe in the lower 80s over the eastern interior, north of the Alaska Range. Otherwise, a weakening front will bring uh, periods of rain will be heaviest along the southern Kenai Peninsula and western Prince William Sound areas, as well as Cordova. And showers are possible over much of the Copper River Basin, and a band of moisture will push up with some rain across the Kobuk Valley into the Seward Peninsula and possibly into the Noatak Valley. Otherwise, look for maybe some clearing on the Arctic coast and North Slope. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm Dave Percy.